straight cruising, headed for bruising, watching out for number one. Wilfred and I are experimenting with my Yorkshire pudding batter because we use it for Yorkshire puddings. Yes, I don't know why they said it feels so good. So we're experimenting to see, and it, oh, there's something not quite happening. It's, it's not, look, it keeps going up. It's right, no, 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 because it needs to cook. I think I might have to turn the temperature down. This is going to be good. If, if that batter does Yorkshire puddings, big and little, plus Dutch baby pancake, plus pancakes, plus waffles. Well, I just don't know if it's... Hmm. I think it needs... I've made it too liquidy. Oh, Will. <laughs> Wilfred's got the massaging gun and he keeps putting it on his butt. Well, I've hung up my pictures that I got from the auction on Friday and um, I really like the effect and the size and all that. It's probably not the best time to be videoing because of all the reflections. This is quite bright. But, oh, isn't hanging pictures just the most frustrating job? For a start, this one here is half a centimetre bigger on that side because the frame's slightly broken. And um, also I've, I've put them up, but because they've got rope string hangings and fittings on the back, as they're sitting there and, the, and they're settling in, they're dropping at different rates. So they're not level or straight anymore. But the more I fiddle about with them, the more it interferes with how they're settling. So I'm just gonna have to leave them. But at least they're up. Oh, squeaky floorboard. I've just got changed. I decided I wanted my caftan on. And the four pictures I've taken off, I'm thinking of putting one there, one there, one there, and one there. But I'm going to live with it for a bit. Oh, that creaky floorboard. It makes me sound like I'm doing blow-offs. I've been travelling about the kitchen trying to find somewhere where I don't look horrendous and where there is no untidy background. But it ain't happening, is it? So, here I am. Look, new spot for the day. I have broken out everywhere. So I've got a mess here. You can see where I put my paintings back up. My stepfather's aunt did these botanical pencil drawings and I've put them up back up all higgledy piggledy wrong pictures on the wrong hook I'm not very good at putting pictures up um just cooking supper we're not having a roast today we're having stew and dumplings I've been catching up with some comments from yesterday <clears throat> and Suze who lives just up the road hello Suze um, she has just said, oh, isn't Bill lovely looking out for his brothers and buying his brothers something? So it's a sweet little story over uh, around why Bill had money. Last week, the week before last, he had a careers convention thing with his school. His school went along to this careers thing. Now, um, they're so sweet how they include Bill in everything. So he went along and, and he said before he went, um, we're going into Bristol and um, I don't think I need any money, but I might need some money. We might get a chance to go to a shop. So can I have some money? And so Toby said, well, I've only got £10 note. You'll have to take that, but please bring back some change. Anyway, he came back and then when Toby got home from work, he said, um, Bill, did you buy anything today and do I have any change? And Bill said, I didn't buy anything and I've put the £10 note on your desk, Daddy. And we were really impressed by that because that was so good. 
So um, later that night, Toby said, Bill, that was really good what you did. So we're going to give you that £10 note. You can have that and you can do what you want with it. So just about to drop my camera, my phone. So um, for the last week, he's been saying, when I'm allowed down into the village, he doesn't really speak quite like that, but he it's a bit like that. He says, um, when I go down to the village, I'm going to buy my brother something and myself something. So that's what he did. He went down to the village and he bought himself something and his brother something. He's so sweet. So he's sweet. Oh, dear little thing. I do worry about him. People can be so mean to him. They just take the mick. And he thinks that they're being kind, but they're laughing at him. It's hard for me because I I can't go and interfere because it'll embarrass him, but I just want to go and give him a what for. Rah! You got it.